Hey guys, what's up? I'm back from uh, my Christmas with the family and stuff like that. So, yep, being back, it actually feels nice. Uh, I got plenty of time to like relax, get my stuff together. Ah, and I am pretty, well, eh, I want to say I want to say I'm pretty behind on everything. I finally just got to level 40 inside of um, the raids and I've Mostly just because I've been attacking everybody else's like Krampus and I had to stop doing that. I recently just made it to level 40. Right now we just already finished the level 39. And I'll get to that sooner or later. But let's go to my progress so far. So far, um, we got uh, Hermes. And Hermes um, is my first 6 star. Uh, I would have chose this character, but she only hits twice. I thought she would hit it four times, but nah, it's pretty much each enemy. Yeah, unfortunately, she only hits like twice. Yeah, I can see a lot of better characters than her, though. But if I actually need like another fire character, I'll definitely go for it. Right now, I haven't really been in the need for one. And I also have um, Hades here that we summoned for. I, I did a whole whole big summon on um, stream when the event had first popped up and I did a few summons um, off screen but I am happy to have Hades because when that skin comes I'm gonna be waiting for that uh, what else I also got this character from like the from, like the milestone yeah she's actually pretty decent just for the shields and everything if I ever need a windshielder then she would definitely help out uh, but mostly we had like really terrible luck. I was hoping for a um, change, but it, Oh boy, it was actually pretty bad <laughs> But we have Our 10 summon here That I'm gonna go into then we're gonna try out the level 40 It's actually kind of funny considering that I always used to do this manual but now I've gotten to the point where I can just auto it and it'll still reach the score I have always made. So I can make it to like 5,800 is what I want to say. I think it's 5,800. No, not 5,800. Um, ah, really? That's all we got? Hold up, where, I'm trying to figure out what the hell, where the hell this is. Oh, is it in my bag? Yeah, there it is. But yeah, I usually make it to like, uh, 500, well, 5, 800,000. Let's say that. <laughs> I guess that's the easier way of saying it. I, I don't know, I was getting confused. Alright, let's see if we have any luck. Uh, this one doesn't have a chance of getting a four star out of it, I'm pretty sure. I don't think this one has the same property as the actual summons inside of a... Uh, the actual summons to where you have a chance of actually getting at least one four star. On the bright side, it's giving me more fodder that I can use for my um, Onyx. What's this four star? Oh, Halloween. That's more on it for me. Oh, another one of her. I can just uh, mix her together. She's actually really good for stopping heals, but I think it's only her drive that does that, right? I think it's only her drive. Uh, yeah, it's only her drive that blocks heals. What a 90% chance. That doesn't go up at all. Uh, we're actually going to do another summon here and see if I can get change. I got, I gotten like everybody else except for change. <laughs> God damn it, game. Please. One change. We're going to keep going until I get to like 15,000 crystals left. I just need like one change. Change will definitely help my team out. And me in like future content. 
That's that's all I need, dude. Please. Oh, five star. Who is it? Ah, Hades again. That's fine. Hades is actually a pretty decent tank, especially for this event versus um Krampus. Another five star. Who is it? Finally! Yes! That's all I needed! Oh! Oh my god. Finally! That's the only thing I needed. You know what? Screw the rest of the summons. <laughs> Jeez. Thank you, game. Ah. There were so many summons before this, you guys don't even know. <laughs> you guys know I say that like 50k. So that was actually worth doing. Jeez. Getting everybody off the banner. Now I can just start saving up for the next banner. Alright, so where is change? There she is. Locking you. And let's just start awakening you. Uh, I'm gonna skip this. I'll go back and watch it myself. Which I always look at the characters' uh, awakens and everything. I just don't want to bore you guys with my reactions because I'm not sure if anybody actually enjoys my reactions for um well my story reactions towards like Destiny Child yet. Alright, she's fully ready to go. Ah, finally. Do I have any gears for you? I'm pretty sure I do. Oh, you're gonna have to deal with that incident. Do you have any good HP? Yeah. HP and defense, that's exactly what I'm looking for. Then I'm pretty sure I have, like, a good trinket. That could be useful, but um, there's another thing I wanted to show you guys or tell you guys as a little bit of a tip. If you're trying to make like a six star, it'll probably be worth it to save all this gold for um, converting. That would probably be the best idea because here's the thing. It's an extremely low and I mean extremely low chance of actually getting the five star evolution material. Uh, where is it? Let's go in here, for example. It's extremely difficult to get these. They they rarely drop, or you can get it from Rumble Shop, but you have to have a crap ton of Rumble Coins. It's better just to convert these. Uh, I'm going to go somewhere else, actually. Uh, let's go... Yeah, I, w I was going to do you next, sooner or later. But yeah, if I wanted to actually finish this, I would have to just be like, oh, let's convert these into this, and I would get like eight of them out of it. But I can keep converting down the road. Actually, I can. Hold up. These you don't really need a lot of, so it's definitely worth converting them. And it does take a lot of gold just to do this. So I would recommend saving up all your gold if you're trying to plan towards like evolving a certain character and getting your first six star okay so I just need uh, six more okay no I need one two more As you guys can see I already used a lot of gold in that most of them were unnecessary but hey so we can make this into that I recommend actually keeping up with your numbers, unlike me. <laughs> okay, so I was always on like one behind. But it does seem like I, I can still keep going though. Hold up. Because I only need 50 for this, right? Oh, wait. Go back there. There we go. And this one, I only need 40. 
So right about there. So I could get this from um, Rumble Shop. And look at all that. <laughs> Actually plan out your stuff better than I just did. Because like I said, it, it takes a lot of gold to convert. And it takes a lot to evolve. Save up all of your gold. Good thing I have not done gold dungeon yet because that would actually really suck right about now. But yeah, I'm pretty much there for evolving a dark unit. I'm gonna get there for evolving a water unit now and that's gonna be change. Um, as for skills, gotta scale that up. Ah, I really wish they would change this back to gold. Because Onyx is just hard to come by, and just releasing it on this every time is going to be really freaking annoying. And it, it's, it sucks. <laughs> it just sucks. Thank you. But yeah, I'm back to streaming and making videos. Thank God. I've been going through withdrawals. I've been actually on like the verge of actually recording something at the time I was just sitting there like dude I want to play something but I want to play it like recording wise but change has been my only goal for this game cuz fuck it <laughs> no I'm serious change has only been my main goal for this so every other character that comes out in the banners are not really an actual priority for me now for now at least until I actually see something I actually want so I can save up a crystals and skip a banner if I need to uh, you guys might end up seeing like the same team every like video at that point if that happens but I'll definitely keep showing you guys pretty much all my progress on my team um, like I said I won't always upload a whole bunch of Destiny Childhood videos just because um, there's not probably a lot going on, but I'll definitely upload like patch notes for you guys and help you guys out as much as I can. I don't have all the knowledge that I can throw from the Korean version to the global version since we're going off the Japanese version and I didn't start with the Japanese version. So some of my mis so some of my information could be like mismatched from what I've said from what I've said. And I do apologize if it is the wrong information. I'll try to correct myself in the community tab or somebody will try to help me out and uh, let me know but yeah we're gonna try out the level 40 rate oh, I missed somebody's at level 40 I'm sorry guys I'm sorry I haven't been helping out with level 40s all right my first level 40 rate I'm gonna watch it auto to be honest because it can just catch up to my score and it knows everything I want to use um, I've been doing this without Diane just because Diane kind of cuts down on my DPS a little bit. So, yeah, this is where I want my, all my damage and my buffers to actually do damage. Right now, the favorite for Fever for the game is um, Hermes, and that's exactly who I use as my Fever since she does the most damage out of Jupiter. So, yeah. All right, team, let's see how you can do in level 40 auto. Always make sure to use your um, your boosters on, like, really high level. Well, at least around, like, level 35 to up, just to get the most out of all the Ragna coins. That would probably be the best to go for. Just because you can get, like, around, like, 3,000 to 5,000 coins off of just um, these bosses but pretty soon I'm gonna become a slayer I don't know if you have to slay it or like be the last person to hit it or if you have to um, just have it die <laughs> alright So far, so good. The only sad part is it doesn't instantly like choose which drive to use like I usually do. Because as soon as I get a drive, I just use it. If anybody dies, uh, 
Matt will revive him. And that happens a lot, where she just basically interrupts you. I don't think Matt will actually use her drive with low HP people. Low HP people. I think she'll use it uh, once somebody dies. Maybe I will have to bring Matt. I mean, Diana. But it looks like he's gaining back HP now. So it doesn't like all that crucial. Pantheon just takes damage <laughs> no matter what. So it's nothing really all that special. But yeah, now that I have changed my damage should be like way higher. I'll probably replace um probably replace Pantheon and throw somebody else in. Oh, well, and throw a change in when I'm done with. All right, we definitely reached around like uh oh god. Okay, never mind. Yeah, we definitely reached around like the uh, 500,000 point. Seems like it might be hitting a little bit more. Because AoE, everybody's still fine. Uh, one person might not be fine in a few seconds. These bombs that have like the little countdown on it hurt like hell. They're like no joke. He might actually be dying towards the end, yeah. <laughs> That's fine. We are almost done anyway. Yeah, see? Pretty much hits around the same score I do. Yeah, normally if it's like around that much, I just break again. If it hits uh, like the highest point, I know I can get off of it. So, from what I can see now, probably could do this. Pretty sure others are going to join in so, since they see level 40 and they're just like, Oh, shit, maybe, dude, maybe I should join this. Yes, please do. <laughs> Make sure to help me out as much as you guys can. Uh, let me go ahead and request support. Dear God, there's a lot of you. I wish I could attack all of you guys right now, but I will do that uh, later. Right now, I gotta focus on mines and getting my Slayer rank because I don't have it yet. <laughs> so we just got here. I really hope I don't have to be the killer. Because if that's the case, I'm gonna have to be really aggressive with this. You know what? Screw it. Let's just keep going. And I'll keep talking to you guys about um, a lot of things. Um, so. Will I be 6R in Jupiter? Probably not. It really depends. Because Jupiter is actually really good for like lowering defense and stuff like that, but I feel like I want a weak point weakener. So, um, hmm. I'm trying to figure out who could be like a good weak point weaken. I know there's an elf and he's win with like this little um, green jacket on. I can't remember his name, but I'm pretty sure he does weakness. Well, weak point weakness. And weak point is just like really good to take advantage of next to normal damage. So during all these raids, try to have like a really good attacker for like bosses. Especially against uh, their like weaker elements. So if you're in the water like raid, Bring, bring a really good attack win. Like um, Krampus, for example. Because Krampus is actually a really good attack win. Just because of her uh, slide being like... Her, he, I'm not really sure yet still. But for both people saying it's a she. But from Krampus, like, slide skill it's actually really good and you can't underestimate it especially when it's going up against a water type if you're going up against a water type with Krampus 
she's gonna do like a lot of damage, like <laughs> a retarded amount of damage, just because Krampus is gonna be going off of this tap skill as well, twice. And that tap skill is no joke. So you would want to increase the tap skill and the slide skill for Krampus. I'm not sure if you can get another Krampus out of um, the Platinum boxes. If anybody knows the drops from the Platinum chests, can you guys uh, let me know down in the comments? Because that would definitely be helpful. Because I don't think they've given us that information of what drops from the chests. If you guys have a link to that, then yeah, definitely give me that. But right now, you can get the skin, which is very rare inside of the Platinum Chest. And it's this skin right here. So, yeah, if you're Raider, well, if you're a Slayer rank and you're already fighting level 40s, keep going. Don't stop. Get that skin while you can, or try and get it while you can. It's actually pretty nice that they give us these events just because we're allowed to get everything on a ranking reward in the middle of all this. So you can get a skin in the middle of just raiding, you can get the character in the middle of raiding. It's just like really helpful that you don't have to be on a leaderboard just to get the rewards. Because that's something that is flawed with a lot of games with like leaderboards and pay to win like assets. The free players can't even get the amazing characters that would be on a leaderboard versus like um Oh let me restart another one here. Oh god, there's four. There's four people in here. Okay. Well they'll they'll probably kill it anyway. But let me just go ahead and do one more attack. But anywho, games, mobile games really have a flaw when it comes to leaderboard, or pretty much any game with a leaderboard has a flaw to that. Just because they're always like, maybe we should just uh, have all the rewards on the leaderboard and just have like a little special event to where they can get some special characters, but not the main strong character. Because money. <laughs> the more you pay, the, the better our game is. But nah, Destiny Child has a little bit more leniency and it's more aimed towards free to play, which is like really nice, thank god. Because it's been a while since we've gotten like a good free to play game. And then the game turned from free to play to pay to win. <laughs> nice Chronicle. Oh. But yeah. Yeah. And some games say free to play for a while, then they automatically randomly go to um, pay to win. Really hoping Destiny Child doesn't go down that route. But for right now, it's extremely free to play since the Korean version and the Japanese version have been up so long. I've never seen them go like pay to win. So we have a good future ahead of us inside of the free to play area. And my whole team is pretty much free to play. I haven't spent a single dollar on this game at all. All of my um, crystals I had was just pretty much just saving for a better banner. And it was actually really worth it. So some of you guys should start doing that for sure, just saving up for a better banner. Don't do what a lot of people did and just went to straight wasting on like any battery they could anytime they got it but yeah I, I kind of feel them on that man you kind of get the drive you want to throw, throw crystals at it you know I, I feel you I had the urge I, I may have done it one or twice <laughs> but well yeah I'm guilty I'm, I'm just gonna admit it I'm guilty I, I've done it <laughs> even when trying to save I, I've done it at least once but like I said, if you need it like a healer or good support or attacker, go for it on a normal banner if there isn't like a better banner up for you. But now that there's a better banner, um, the characters that are in there are pretty damn worth it. Hades, really good fire tank towards um, like single target. Yeah, pretty much like single target enemies. Especially with like really strong sliding skills. Because Haiti has a taunt and a reflect. And I'm pretty sure he also has like a shield as well. So Haiti's 
pretty much of a selfish tank, from what um, people have said, and they're right. Hades is a really selfish tank to where eh, he doesn't really protect your team. He he mostly just puts all the buffs on himself. But he also has a taunt, which makes him a little bit less selfish. But he has a shield that's only to himself. Let's just say that. So, also, let's go into Hermes. Hermes is really good for increasing damage. I'm not sure if her attack increase only goes to the automatic attacks or if it goes down to, I want to say, all of the slide skills or stuff. Because I know there's tap damage and there's other stuff to it. But I'm not really too sure about that yet. I'm going to explain it real soon. This is what I mean about saving your boosters for this. Definitely worth it. Oh, I got a platinum? Come on. Give me the skin. Ah, no, it's a summon. What is this? Oh, it's you. I actually really like her design. So, we finally done it. Become a Slayer. So I didn't have to kill it. Good. Good to know. So now, let's look at the Slayer ranks. <laughs> How's everybody doing over here? Oh. Oh yeah, Slayer raids don't open until like a few weeks later. Well, uh, I think it's on 12 days. Yeah, oh, it's probably on 12 days. But we finally made it. That's good. So Slayer rank is basically just get as many kills from the bosses as you can. I guess like last hits. The most uh, kills are on the uh, rankings. But yeah, we finally did it. Thank God. I keep wondering, what is all this random bonus stage? How do people get that? Huh. I'm gonna help this guy out. Because he's not um, level 40 yet. But, Hermes, really good, decent. I would actually recommend her as a good support. That's why I six starred her. Um, so let's go on. I'll go back to the whole tap skill and side skill stuff for her later. I want to get everybody else in. Um, as for change, change is extremely fucking good as a support. Like, it's no joke of how good she is. She literally... She literally cuts this little cool time down by two. So your cooldown, your skill cooldown is going to be like pretty much going through its cycle once again. So you can see this time it'll jump from straight from two to ready to go. And plus she also has a, um, her tap skill has a 50% chance to just fully make the bar go around. Huh. Pretty much insta charge. So let's just say you just got out of the cooldown and your characters is just started charging like around a circle. As soon as you click change she actually gets that 50% to where she could just instantly fill up the circle. Their character can go ahead and use a tap or slide skill. Which is actually really, really good. But she only aims for the highest attackers when it comes to um, the slide skill of charging their skills way faster, which is actually really good because you want your attackers to do more damage as quick as possible before the time is up, which is going to help you in the long run. So I would recommend 6-starring um, change because she's going to be useful for a huge amount of content in the future. Even She's even useful in here and she's a water type. But I would recommend having her 6-star before you actually bring her in here because she's going to have a rough time staying alive when, when this insane maniac's on the field. I, I can't say I did struggle through Santa and the rest because um, I didn't have like a main like attacker for them. I didn't have a water type for Rudolph. I didn't have like a wood attacker for Santa. So that, yeah, I struggled into them. But I, most of the reason why I'm just not making it here is just because I didn't, I didn't really attack my units too often, which is kind of on me. And I will take the fall for that because I just wasn't thinking about it. I was just thinking about getting as many points as I could, as fast as I could. And then I remembered 
Oh crap, maybe I should be doing my, my raids so I can be Slayer rank. <laughs> so, yeah. And plus I wanted a chance to get the like, skin out of the Platinum. Out of the Platinum chest, so... Yeah, now that we're on that, I'm going to just keep grinding this out, and I'll help most of you guys who are on my friend list. And most of you guys just filled up my friend list like it was nothing. Like, jeez, you guys are insane. Just out there, like, as soon as the raid event... Well, the raid, raid event pretty much brings out a lot of people um, out of you. Okay, they, they should be able to do that. But the raider Brent event brings out a lot of people adding you especially if you do a lot of damage on like the first few stages but you guys have definitely filled up my friend list just from adding me i know a lot of random people don't know that i do youtube so yeah they probably added me out of that it's sad because i want to keep this guy just because he could actually be really good and helpful it's out of the raid event but doesn't seem like he's active, so okay. I always remove inactive people past like uh, let's say four days. If you haven't been on for four days, then I I'll probably end up removing you. Okay, can we? Wait, you don't have the. Okay, thank you. That's that's what I was looking for. Let's make it a lot easier to remove people. Yeah, all these people aren't coming back. Oh wow, you have you have buddy with me, and you're no longer active. Feels bad, dude. Because after four days, I'm just guessing. Hey, you're not coming back at all. All right, so we're good now. So if you want to add me, go for it. I'll give you guys my um. code once again there you go and i will see you guys on the next one because i need to go start doing those raids and hitting everybody's um krampus getting like some more score and stuff so hope you guys enjoyed thanks for stopping by and i'll see you guys on the next one back to making videos damn right <laughs> to then peace out please don't have another boss thank you I shall be right back after I'm done with all my dailies. Alright. To uh, 25. So this would be like 29. Oh, finally. Who is it? Change, please? Oh, no way. Okay, I will take that. Hermes will be, like, really nice stuff. Okay, who else? Double Hermes? Well, okay, that's the first. Alright, then. Another double. And we got some... Can I get a triple, then? I was kind of hurt hoping for change out of this, but that's nice. I'll take that. What is it? Okay, Halloween. Wait, hold up. No. Gotta make sure that we're later okay yeah we're on 29 let me go out here grab these that's okay yeah that's 200 uh... oh 2700 basically another free summon See what we get now. Four star. 
I haven't seen you before. Five star? Who is it? Oh, Hades. Oh, okay, I, I'll take Hades any day. <laughs> I will take Hades any day. Okay, so how many of that? Okay, we got another summon. I should have just broadcast all these summons then. So this is where all my luck went. Apparently in the video, <laughs> I don't get any luck, but on stream, the luck is like really good. Okay, what's this one? Okay, another one. We are not done yet. A lot of onyx by the end of this. Five star, please. Nah. This is the first time I've gotten you. It's funny because your own sensor skin looks way, way better. What would be the last one? Will it be gold or will it be nothing? Okay, so yeah, that's what